Alrighty, here we go! Another Inktober day! And today was a little tough for me, just because today's word on Jake Parker's prompt list was screech. Now, when I thought of screech, I automatically thought of an owl, and I wanted to draw Harry and Hedwig, but I already drew Harry, and I probably will draw Harry again, but, um... I just wanted to leave it towards the end like I wanted to space out my Harry Potter uh, doodles just because you know I don't want them so close together so then I thought well screech I think of a bird and when I think of birds I'm trying to think of a bird that screeches a lot <laughs> so I naturally thought of Donald Duck throwing a tantrum because let's face it when he throws a tantrum all his little antics of him yelling and throwing a fit sounds like a bunch of screeches <laughs> he is such he is such a temperamental bird <laughs> that it, it just seemed too much of a good opportunity to pass up drawing donald throwing a temp temper tantrum <laughs> So with uh, Donald, I went back to my little, just my regular Bic ballpoint pen, and I actually went to Michael's in search of some pretty ink. And when I was looking in Michael's for some pretty ink, just because I like to, I, I got my plain ink, my Bombay black ink, and then I thought, well, I'd like to have some more colors because some people are, are using more ink colors. Like I follow a couple of awesome artists that are participating in Inktober and they're just, they're coloring in their doodles with some ink. And I mean, I have been doing that, but I've been trying to keep it to a minimum. So I went to Michael's with my friend Wes and we were looking for just regular ink. And then we saw that there were a bunch of pearlescent inks, like a package of pearlescent inks on the bottom shelf. Now, when I was reading it, it says that it's liquid acrylic. And I'm like, that doesn't seem right because all the calligraphy artists that I follow on Instagram, they all use pearlescent as like an ink thing. So I looked at the side and as you can see on the side, it had like all these different like pen options. They had a fountain pen option. It comes in a dropper and I was just really confused like liquid acrylic. So then, of course, I went into some reach, research, 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 and I went on Dollar and Roni's actual website to read up on their liquid acrylic artist ink, and it says that it's acrylic-based, pigmented, water-resistant ink on most surfaces in ranges of 38 colors, of all which have three or four star rating for performance. So it's ink. I mean, who would have known that it was ink? But hey, it counts. So I highly suggest that if you want like a little bit of accent to your ink doodles this month, we've got three weeks left. We're at the beginning. I mean, we're not at the beginning, but we're like, really, we're already in. So here, you can see them right here. And they come in a set of six at Michael's and I went in with a 50% coupon, so did Wes, and he bought a set and I bought a set and it, we got like, it was like the 50% off one regular item and these were regular item and so they turned out to be only $17. They were 34 in real life and then there was a 20% coupon. I mean, they are so beautiful and shiny and shimmery and they're wonderful to like experiment with. So hey, if you're looking for some inks, go and check out Michael's or Hobby Lobby. But Michaels has these sweet coupons, so I would go and check them out. Well, I'll see you guys tomorrow.